guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am collaborating with That's It again to make a mango, coconut, fruit, and nut bar. I love including That's It probiotic bars in recipes because it not only brings a serving of fruit to the recipe, but it also brings probiotics to the recipe, which are great for gut health and overall health. That's It probiotic bars only contain fruit and probiotics, so they're a great snack to grab and go when you're in a hurry. For this recipe, I'm starting with a cup each of chopped almonds, chopped walnuts, and chopped pecans, and I'm going to add in a half a cup of unsweetened shredded coconut, a quarter cup of pumpkin seeds, a quarter teaspoon of pink Himalayan salt, three mango probiotic That's It bars cut into small chunks, and a half a cup of honey. bars I like to cut them in three long strips and then I cut them in small chunks going the other way. You want to make sure that you thoroughly mix everything together before you add in the honey, otherwise it won't mix well. Now that everything's mixed together well, I'm going to pour in the honey and then keep mixing. Once everything's combined, you will want to pour the mixture onto a parchment lined cookie sheet. This should cover about two thirds of the cookie sheet and you want to press it down until it's about a half an inch thick. A trick to spread this out without getting your hands all sticky is to take another sheet of parchment paper and place it on top and you can just press down. pressed together, I'm going to pop it in the oven at 350 for about 15 to 18 minutes or until I start to see it getting golden. Once your bars have completely cooled, you can slice them into the size that you like, but you need to make sure that they cool completely because the honey won't harden until they're cool. That's all for this video, but be sure to check out That's It and all of their delicious snacks, and give this video a like if you enjoyed it, and subscribe to my channel for new videos every Sunday. See you next time!